Hello everyone, how are you doing? This is MD Tech here with another quick tutorial. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you guys how to hopefully resolve if you're getting an input not supported error. So if your computer's resolution does not match with that of your monitor, this tutorial will hopefully be able to get your new monitor up and running without too much of an issue. So we're going to start by opening up the start menu, just left click on the start button one time, and you want to type in msconfig, so msconfig. Best match should come back with system configuration. I'm going to left click on that one time to open it up. Now you want to left click and navigate to the boot tab. Now that we're on the boot tab here, you want to check mark inside the box here to enable base video. So once you've done that, this will ensure the monitor is able to pick up the display signal when you're going back to boot into your normal profile. So left click on apply and OK. So you might see you need to restart your computer. Left click on restart here.
Okay guys, once you boot it back into Windows, you want to right click on your desktop, just in a blank spot, and then you want to left click on display settings. So depending on what version of Windows you're running, it might open up a different window here, but the concept should be the same for everybody. So you want to go down to resolution here, adjust what you need to, so click inside the box, and then play around with different resolutions in here. So if something isn't working right, you can go play around with the resolution. Just left click on revert if you don't like how it initially looks, and go work around it until you find the resolution that matches your monitor, if you did not already know. And if you had any multiple displays, left click on this detect button as well to go scan ahead for any other potential monitors that are hooked up. And again, I do hope this brief tutorial was able to help you guys out. And as always, thank you for watching, and I do look forward to catching you all in the next tutorial. Goodbye.